I don't want my kid in now, I want my kid in. You know, and all parents were advised that you can, you can opt in and then opt out. But you can't opt out and then opt in because we've, we've made specific plans, transportation has made specific plans. So what if you opt out, you're doing the online learning? Correct, and, and you know, the beauty is that the children didn't show up today, hopefully are still present because they're at home virtual. Right. Why didn't they, why do you think they didn't show up today, some of the kids? Like you said you had an empty bus. I'm, I'm, you know what, I wish I could tell you, I would, you know, was it weather, um, was it, they struggled with the child, getting the child ready, um, last minute, um, uh, what's the word, uh, last minute, uh, um, Thoughts of uh, I'm not sure. I mean, I'm, I I couldn't tell you. You know, if we all think as parents, what would hold us from sending our child to school? You know, how many, beyond the pandemic. <laughs> how many children were due to come today, and how many did? Like I said earlier, well, we we don't have. We're still waiting for buses, right? So we don't have the full attendance. But like I told you earlier, about 95 is today's number. Is the total correct? And then 95 during on the alternate days too. No, again, uh, Monday, Tuesday, we're gonna we sh if all kids are present, we'll have the same amount of kids. Right. Wednesday, we only have our intense kids, our five day kids. Thursday, Friday, it's a different cohort, but it's about we balanced it to about 70 kids, cohort A, cohort B, each cohort, plus 25 of our um, special classes that come every, every day, 25. which is cohort C. Yeah.